first those shocking pictures of teenagers risking their lives climbing to the top of a derelict roller coaster. They were seen more than 80 feet up the old nightmare ride at Camelot theme park. The site near Chorley closed three years ago. It's claimed hundreds of children have been seen there and residents say more security is needed before someone falls to their death. Our correspondent Matt O'Donoghue reports. So we've just been uh, busted by security. Heading back down the road goes now. This guy down here has got us. Balanced up to 80 feet in the air, these urban explorers take their lives in their hands as they carefully tread the tracks once ridden by roller coaster thrill seekers. This is Camelot the theme park in 2015. The other side of that barbed wire, there's 40 acres of derelict amusement park, but just along this short run of security fencing, maybe 100, 150 metres long, I've counted at least 19 holes. Some like this one have been repaired two, possibly three times. But others, like this one, directly beneath the danger keep out sign, are still wide open. Once adrenaline junkies travelled for miles to ride these rails, today people still make the journey to Camelot but for entirely different reasons. Photography students from Southport College and our project at the minute is recession. And we've just come to take some photographs of abandoned, the abandoned theme park, obviously. I thought it'd be quite interesting as a photography project. Ben and Jordan assured us they had no intention of scaling the steel structures beyond these barbs. But as these gut twisting pictures show, many others have different ideas. Okay, this is, uh, this is where the young people get access to it and they climbed through, then they got access to right through the park. I think it's the onus is on the owners of the site to make it secure. Uh, that's what um, everybody's concerned about, people who live locally and people who travel a fair distance away to come and young people being young people, they want to adventure and so on. In 2012, the turnstiles stopped turning and this site was sold to Story Homes. In a statement, they say, we have a full-time on-site security team in place, security fencing around the roller coaster and security guards patrolling the roller coaster area. They applied for planning permission to build 420 houses, but the plans were knocked back last year. I think what we've got to see, new safety measures put in place, better security and the dismantling of this old equipment. Clear it once and for all. It's a nice off the area and it's now a real danger and is posing a threat to young people. Story homes have been caught in planning limbo and with each day that passes, news of the now rotting roller coasters of Camelot spread like a virus online, attracting a whole new generation of thrill seekers just a step away from death. Matt O'Donoghue, ITV News, Chorley.